what has got to do the lineage of Joseph with Jesus? You tell me. What historical? What what is that? Do they know Jesus? And guess what? When was written the first uh, gospel? When? Seventy years. Who was there? Who saw them? Did anyone see Matthew when he was writing? Who did he hand it to after he finished? What's his surname? What's Matthew's surname? What's Matthew's surname? Who, where was he? <laughs> where was he? Who saw when they were writing? 70 years later, and the first Gospels, Bible, you know when was compiled? After 300 years later. Shame. So now you want to talk about the credibility of your book. It does not even support you. Even 1 John 5, 7, John 5, 4, Matthew chapter 17, verse 21, Matthew chapter 18, verse 11, and verse 11, time, Matthew time, time, chapter, time, 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 okay, all these verses time. Christians no, no, disagree no, no. Time, about. Time, 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 time. Okay, talk. I told you the Mickey Mouse tea towel Siraj doesn't have a clue. Yeah. He bit more than he chew and he is now scared. He tried every attempt to run away, but he failed. The water isn't helping him right now. Note carefully, the topic at hand is who is more his who is historical? Jesus or Muhammad of Islam? Did he even say anything about Muhammad of Islam? Nothing. Zilch whatsoever. All of you Muslims who are watching, note carefully. Even despite this tea towel, there is no information about Muhammad. Time to leave Islam. I gave you a long list. Muhammad from Mecca. Persecu uh, apparently receiving revelation in Mecca. Persecuted by pagan Meccan Arabs. Running away on a hijra from Mecca to Medina. Forming an Islamic Ummah in Medina. And uh, uh, including three Jewish tribes. Subsequently them being wiped out. And then returning to Mecca. Eventually taking over Mecca. And making all of Hijazi as an Islamic land. Which is then followed by Rashidun caliphate with the identities of Islam as religion, Muslim as the person who follows the religion and Muhammad as the prophet of Islam. There is zilch evidence, zilch evidence for any of this, all of this. Like how our gentleman friend here is a Mickey Mouse tea towel, Islam also is a Mickey Mouse Harry Potter fantasy story coming to London Learning English hasn't helped him learn history. He is too scared of history. Time to leave Islam. Contrary to that, come to my precious Lord Jesus Christ. He did not hear properly, my dear friends. He said, I only quoted the Bible. He needs some eardrops. He needs to clear his ear from wax. I made mention not just of the biblical books. I also referred to non-Christian credible historians, Romans, Tacitus, Suetonius, Pliny the Younger, Greek, uh, Lu Lucian of Samosata, Jewish non-Christian sources, Babylonian Talmud and uh, 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 Josephus, all of these put together for the Bible, we have thousands of manuscriptal evidence taking the Gospels to the first century. And add to that, the many, many thousands of translations in other languages. My precious Lord Jesus Christ, including in His death, burial, resurrection, is strongly historical and He has stood up to scrutiny for centuries. Like Him, the Mickey Mouse Islam does not have a credible historical prophet. Leave Islam, Three minutes. come follow stop, stop. Jesus Three minutes. Christ. Three minutes. Okay, okay, the mental bus. Wait, 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 wait. The mental bus now. Yeah, okay. The mental bus now. He went historical, yes? If you search up who is the greatest man of all time, it's Prophet Muhammad. I can Google him, search up. It's not Jesus. Jesus is the third one. Not Mus by non Muslims. In America, America Supreme Court in uh, some state, they said Quran is the the best justice book. I'm not saying it's a it's not it's a non-Muslim history. So now, so now, listen. So now, so now, so now. Look, he used Matthew, Mark, John, 
and I'm using the companions of the Prophet, Abu Bakr, Omar, Ali, Uthman, Talha, Saeed ibn Zaid, Umar, uh, uh, ibn Abdullah ibn Umar, ibn Mas'ud, Ma'ad ibn, Mujal, ibn Jabal, and, Sa and Saeed ibn Sa'ad ibn Abi Waqas, all this, Zubair ibn Al-Awam, all this, they talk about the Prophet. He used the disciples of Jesus, but I am known, as I said before. Matthew, he made mistake about the lineage of Jesus. Are you telling me Matthew took time with Jesus and he does not know the lineage of Jesus? Matthew chapter 1, all the way chapter 1, verse 1, all the way to verse 16. He said he was telling about the lineage of Joseph, the stepfather, instead of telling us the lineage of Jesus. Shame. John himself, chapter 21, verse 24, is telling us that's not John who is talking. No way he says, look, Mark never took time with Jesus. Paul never took time with Jesus. He's believing some random who came out from mental bus. Yeah, anonymous people. Sanem is unknown. We don't know who, we do not know who they are. So now he's trying to justify his Bible. Yet what? Holy Spirit, according to Christians, is not guiding them. Do you know why? Some verses were edited and removed. Example, John chapter 5, verse 4. John 1, John 5, 7. Matthew chapter 17, verse 21. Matthew chapter 18, verse 11. Matthew chapter 20, verse 16. Matthew chapter 23, verse 14. Mark chapter 9. Okay, Mark chapter 7, verse 16. Mark chapter 9, verse 44, verse 46, verse 49. Luke chapter 17, chapter 17, verse 26. Luke chapter 23, verse 7 and 23, verse 17. All these verses are missing. Some of them were edited and removed. Which one did God inspire? We do not know. Also, I'm giving some many verses. Which one did God inspire? Even according to this book, is the credibility of this book is unreliable. How can you use that book? It's, it's put, it put it under the bus. Cool. Last round, you said. All right, my dear friends. I told One you. One more time. The Mickey Mouse T Tower Siraj does not even understand the topic at hand. He lied big time on camera. He quoted people such as Abu Bakr. I don't know why he did that. Did Abu Bakr write any book in history? Did the companions of Muhammad write anything in history? They wrote nothing. These were the, the who are called the companions of Muhammad are later day fancy, fanciful stories of people who are figments of imagination cooked up by later day, later day mythicists. This is who they precisely are. In terms of historical records, we do not have anything from Abu Bakr, Umar, Uthman, Ali. These guys, no one even knows if they even existed or not. There is no credible historical evidence even for their existence. So don't quote nonsense and think you have made a point, Siraj. I really see you struggling to talk about history. And that is where, may I please recommend to you, it is time for you to leave Islam. Leave Islam, you won't have any of these problems. Come to follow the Lord Jesus Christ, you will be in perfect place. You will understand you're following God who is historically attested. With Islam, Muhammad, you're following a later day. Centuries later came the Mickey Mouse stories. Nothing early for the details I asked for. What did I say? Muhammad being from Mecca, supposedly receiving a revelation, entering into, co into a conflict with pagan Meccan Arabs, and then trying to run away to Hijra, uh, to Medina on Hijra. Having, a con having an Islamic Umar there, having a conflict with the Jews there, and then eventually eradicating them, finally returning to Mecca to take over. For none of these is there positive evidence. 
All claims about these are from centuries later. In contrast, there are negative evidence from early times. We have evidence enough to suggest that the city Mecca could not have even existed. <laughs> that the Rashidun Caliphate could not have even existed. That the Hijra could not have even happened. Every major building block could not have been true. We have evidence for that. And that is where I'm trying to see if the tea towel Siraj could give us evidence, which he failed to do. In contrast for Jesus Christ, like I said, solid historians, including non-Christians, but precisely including Christians too, come to Jesus Christ, you won't have to struggle. Desperate Google searches, you won't need. Come okay, now is my Christ. time. Last one. Last one minute. This guy, Last one minute. this guy, he puts Christianity under the bus again. Do you know why? Because he used Jews. What do Jews believe about Christianity? I don't worshippers what do they believe about jesus a false prophet a false messiah a false god so thanks for using Jew, Jew, the jews as every as an evidence so now what do jews believe about islam they can pray in a mosque in a in mosque they believe islam is the correct religion they believe they have same god as muslims they believe the book of Psalm, chapter 84, verse 5, 4 to 6. <laughs> the valley of Bakka. Where is Bakka? Another name of Mecca in the Quran. Quran, chapter 3, verse 97. So what Allah said, the first house was built for mankind to worship Allah is what? The one in Bakka. What's Bakka? Another name is Makkah. Where is time, that? Time, time, no, three one minutes. Minute. Not yet. No, 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 last one minute reset. Psalm chapter 84, verse 4 to 6. Last six. one minute reset. So now, Siraj, according to Jesus, Siraj, Siraj, did he, was Jesus Siraj, resurrected? We said last one was minute. Jesus, is Jesus oh, resurrected okay, according to Jews? No. So he puts again no, no, come, the crucifixion of Jesus no, 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 under the bus. The crucifixion of Jesus and the resurrection of Jesus is under the bus. Why? Jews believe what? The guy they killed never came back to the world. Christians believe. The Christians believe what? So according to him, what Jews say about Jesus is correct. What do they believe? Jesus is a son of bastard. So thanks for using Jews as an evidence, a rule. Are you sick in the head? Mr. Mental Bus, what happened? Shall I help you with the tablet? I have it in case if you go to you the house. carry home. that normally, yeah? No, I have it. You want to? <laughs> Shall I help you? Are you so done? now, Arul, who is your God? Who is the God of Jesus? Who do you worship? Who did Jesus worship? And uh, one, min one thing, yeah, I need to mention. He used Mark Matthew. We don't even know when they wrote it. They said 70 years roughly. Do you have any evidence that they wrote it 70 years later or 90 years later? When was the first Bible compiled? 300 years later after Jesus ascended. So now who wrote it? Any eyewitness? But imagine we have chain narration about the prophet, the Hadith, from Bukhari, the guy who had from Bukhari, all the way to the prophet. Do you have like that in your Bible? No. How can I rely with this book? Tell me. Was Jesus three days and three nights in the grave? No. Another verse, yes. Matthew chapter 12, verse 38 to 40. But another verse, Matthew, Jesus was only what? Two nights and one day in the grave. So which one shall we believe? John chapter 20, verse 1, all the way to the end. Matthew chapter 28, Matt and Luke done, chapter done, 16, done, 24. Done, 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 Mark chapter done, 16. Done, 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 so done, done, goodbye. Done, 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 you can speak done, done. now. Anyways. Excuse me, I am I am lost. Okay, Why are you running away? I'm lost. Yeah. Oh, so no, wait, wait. Yeah. Please, stay focused. Time. So what was the tea towel Siraj, Mickey Mouse Siraj speak doing? Just he post. was complaining that he Good luck anyways. properly at night. He was complaining, complaining that he didn't take an ambi change break properly. He was complaining about all sorts of things outside of the agreed topic at hand. The agreed topic at hand wasn't whether Siraj likes the color brown or black. It's rather who is historical.